Simeon, Ekpas boys, were arrested. This after Biafra declaration in Finland. The situation surrounding Simeon Ekpa, the Finland based separatist leader associated with the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, has taken a dramatic turn following his recent arrest. Reports indicate that Simeon Epa's followers have also been apprehended with disturbing video footage circulating on social media platforms showing them confessing why suffering visible injuries. Many allegedly inflicted during their detainment. This troubling development has raised concerns regarding human rights violations and the treatment of those held in custody. Recall, November has not been kind to Simeon Ekba, marking a significant downturn in his fortunes. His unexpected arrest by Finnish and his Finland authorities attributed to suspicious surrounding terrorism related activities came as a shock to many but, but was met with relief by numerous Nigerians and officials from the Nigerian government particularly in the southeastern region Observers suggest that this incident may signify the unwavering of Simeon Ekpa's formidable persona, which he cultivated as a staunch advocate for Biafra's independence. Recall Simeon Ekpa first gained public attention. In Nigeria after the controversial extradition of Inamdi Kanu, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, from Kenya in the year 2021. So Inamdi Kanu has since been detained by the Nigerian government thereby facing various legal challenges. In the wake of Kanu's arrest, Simeon Epa emerged as a prominent figure, positioning himself as a key ally. However, a significant rift developed between him and the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP, over strategic and operational disagreement, thereby leading to the establishment of his own faction, known as the autopilot. This gave the group of a bad name that has been implicated in violent incident, an attack in the southeastern states, contributing to a climate of fear and instability and several impeachment the local auto economy, particularly through enforced seat at home order. Despite his self proclaimed title 
as the Prime Minister of the Biafran Republic government in his Simeon Epa's legal troubles only appear to be worsening reports from his recent court apprehension. All appearance revealed that he has distanced himself from this title, asserting instead that he is merely a member of the Biafran movement. This apparent retreat from his previous claims raising or rather raises questions about his influence and credibility within the separatist movement. And so, as the Nigerian government claimed to have played a diplomatic role in the security of Simeon Ekpa's arrest, the military's advocacy for his extradition to Nigeria has another layer of complexity to the situation. Also, the defense headquarters has expressed a keen interest in ensuring that Simeon Ekpa faces charges back home when which could lead to further legal battles and political bailout. The unfolding events surrounding Simeon Ekpa highlight the turbulent dynamics of the Biafran separatist movement, showcase the challenges faced by leaders and followers alike. Miss a backdrop of increasing security or scrutiny and legal repercussions. As this high stake drama continues to develop, the implication of both Ekpa's faction and the broader struggle for Biafra autonomy remains on setting. So guys, how do you see to this shocking matter? As regards the Biafran Republic declaration, as soon as it occurs in Finland, and as soon as Simeon Ekpa's arrest, things begin to fall apart. So guys, what are your views? On this matter, kindly share your comment on the comment section. And do not forget to like and subscribe to Bliss Channel. Thank you.